I what is here. this? Oh, it's a um, it's like a drive-in diner. Okay. So you just pull up to a little kiosk, you hit the button, you tell them what you want. It's it's America's Drive-in, is what they call it. It's the original drive-in idea. You pull up, you hit the button, you radio in. They bring out your food. But, but, it, but it's a oh, so you sit in the parking lot and they bring yes. it out to you. Yeah. Oh, okay. They used to do it on roller skates, and then too many people fell and got injured in lawsuits. Yeah, well. <laughs> and it's too bad because it was real. It was like a nice thing, right? Like they bring it out on wheels, like roller skates, and it was like this fun thing. And it was like they're defining. It's like how Johnny Rockets used to do on um, dancing on the tables when you picked music. Yep. It, it's like, well, just don't fall off the fucking table then. That's not on me. That's on you. Back in the good old days. Before yeah. health and safety got involved. Yeah, health and safety is a bunch of bitches. <laughs> I mean, we say that, but I'm very glad that I don't work at a restaurant that makes me dance on a table. I, I want to be the person going to the restaurant that you dance on the table to, though. Yes. Like, <laughs> yes. Think of the consumer. We're supposed to be consumer-oriented, <laughs> right? You want to be oriented towards the people, well, right? In, Not businesses. In, maybe in your country. Well, no, because... I would say our, most people say that America is for the businesses and not the consumer because we don't really have very many pro-consumer laws on the books. A pro-consumer uh, law would say, let them dance on the table, damn it. No, I, well, I, I think in the U.S. is more for the business, not for the people who work for the business. Exactly. True. Yeah, but they they signed up. They know what they're getting into, right? <laughs> <laughs> hey, just sign this waiver, please. <laughs> Look. I'm a business owner. I know how it is. And if you fall on your roller skates and you don't have insurance, then we're going to harvest your kidneys. <laughs> oh, look. You don't need them anymore. Yeah. Oh, man. All right. Oh, There's right. some scouting going on here. We didn't introduce our players, but uh, we can do it super quickly. In the bottom left-hand corner, it's Y2Kid as the yellow Protoss. And in the top left-hand corner, it is Bagel Pirate as the pink Protoss. Both have done their 99 gates, and both are now <laughs> doing the honorable one gate cyber. No, nice PvP is meant to be played one gate versus two gate, though. Uh, yes, yes. But I quite like seeing one gate versus one gate. It means that hopefully, 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 fingers crossed, we're going to get some Reaver on Reaver action. Uh, True. Which sometimes can be a complete shit show and sometimes can give a lot of joy. Yeah, shit show for the person losing, maybe. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh. I mean, just a shit show when the, when the Reaver right. shoots its scarab and the scarab like, decides, I'm not in this game. I, uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm just going to stand actually. here and watch. <laughs> yeah. You know what? I did not vote for this wall. <laughs> Dude, OBS and Twitch are giving me mixed signals here. Oh, yeah? OBS is telling me that my bit rank is just, like, all over the place. And I look over at Twitch where I have, like, a little line that tells me, like, what my bit rate is. And it's just, like, mm -hmm. it's got a little bit of jitter in it, but, like... It's still all That's green. Fine, yeah, yeah so, so I'm like, I don't Super know what green. you're on about. Super green. Well, we'll find out because if this game doesn't go up on YouTube, it's because I watched it back and went, this is hard to watch. Hmm. But then again, that would imply that I watch back my videos before I upload them, which I don't. <laughs> so, like. Interesting that Bagel has managed to take a lead in tech. Uh, without really doing anything. Uh, he just yeah. built things faster. Uh, he's yeah, got a second I... gate coming up. Why two kid haven't even sniffed his second gate yet? Um, no. And I mean, that shows in the amount of money. Is he going to... All right, now he's going to drive. I was going to say, is he going to try and expand while he's pushing? And any more tech coming out of Bagel? Nothing yet. Don't fight up a ramp. Oh, bye, goon. Remember, guys, you should not drink the blue goon juice. It's not good. It's not good for you. Okay, observer first out of Y2 Kid. Observer already building from Bagel. Yeah. Oh, and there's the Robo Bay. All right, what do you think about dropping the Robo Bay and the observatory at the same time? Um. Cause I don't think you should. 
I mean, Observer's built super fast. So, yeah. I think Y2 Kit built the Ripper base slightly too early, but I think it's fine. Yeah, it's one of those things, it's like, you don't need both at the same time, because you can only build one unit out of your robot at a time, right? Mm -hmm. So it's like, yeah, just build your observatory, and then you, you need the time for it to finish, plus your observer, plus you're probably going to go shuttle first anyway. So you can drop it in anywhere in there, you know, push it off, yeah, get some much stuff. Not necessarily. I think the way that they're playing, they're probably not building the shuttle first. That's fair. Uh, normally, normally, you'd build the shuttle before the observer if you were going shuttle first. Interesting. Oh, no, and he lost that observer. Well. Yeah, because, I mean, your your robo's not doing anything until the observatory finishes, right? That makes sense. So you, so you start the shuttle, and then when it's two-thirds, three-quarters done, then you build the observatory. All the right. Robot. Okay, chilling outside. Yeah, just putting pressure on, keeping them contained. Just chilling. Third we vibe. Bagel. We vibing. Oh, it looks like they, yeah, Bagel is comfortable enough to take a next as he knows that his robot's on the way. So that means he probably skipped that shuttle. Uh, it looks like yeah. Whitey could just skip the shuttle as well. Reaver moving slightly forward. This is always a, a scary point. Bagel knows it. So he steps back a little bit and makes it so that the, the Reaver has to walk down the ramp in order to get a shot off. Yeah, um, if the Reaver can does... stay on top of the ramp and fire at you, you you've already lost. Thank you. Uh, Good news for Bagel is he has that observer, so he can see if anything moves down the ramp. But otherwise, being in this position, you'd have to, like, yeah, you'd be a little bit worried. Okay, he is going to move. See, Bagel does respond quickly, but he does have a goon disadvantage. Yeah. Being pushed back across the map. So, that was fine. That was good. He still has the observer in place. He can see whether or not Y2 Kid is moving across the map, which at the moment he isn't. Looks yeah. like he's going to take a next Ooh, zone. second Reaver. So, he didn't go... I thought he was going to go Observer, Reaver, Observer, right? Because, you know, obviously he lost his Observer. But no, he went Double Reaver. Which means I assume an Observer's coming now, or a Shuttle. Well, when when you see your Observer get sniped, you know he's probably not going DTs. So you can skip your Observer. Uh, True. Your second one. You don't need it. Um, I was just thinking for scouting, nice. but... Yeah. But what do you need to scout? That's true. Yeah, I guess I play Zerg where I have, like, standards and morals that I adhere to. Well, now he has got that observer. Uh, I mean, it, you're right. It would be nice if he had known that Bagel Pirate had that nexus. But at this point, you can tend to assume that he has it. Of course, yeah. it's not incredibly safe to assume that he has it. But based on the amount of goons that were outside the natural, like, yeah, it's a safe bet. All right. What are we doing up here, Y2? Are we just scouting around with a probe? Oh. Good. No, we are not just scouting around. Round, round, get around. I scout around. I mean, it's nice right. to have these pawns there. It just sort of lets you know as soon as they take the third, because yeah. these... Or they fly those, out with a shuttle. Or, uh, yeah, it's not a great spot for flying out with shuttle catching, but it's, yeah, it's important to know when they're expanding, because that's when you go and kill them. Interesting. I'm learning. I'm learning Protoss things. I don't know. He's putting a symmetrical one down here, too. Which, I mean, I guess still doesn't mean it's not for checking for expands, but... It also gives you a little bit of peace of mind, right? When you have that nice ring of vision. Yeah, you know everything that's going on. Yeah, I think... I don't like the position of it, though. If it's for scouting, it should be further away from the edge of the map. True. All right. He's going to move out, though. We're going to hope that some goons or something get set up there. And So how are we looking in terms of army versus army? So we've got 15 goons from Y2 Kid. We've got 7, 13, 15. Yeah, 15 on both sides. Only one Reaver for Bagel. Yeah, oh, we have Reaver a home for Y2. Does he have two in the shuttle? Yeah, that one just popped, I think. Okay. It's a fresh one. No, we had a goon. Oh, okay. Whew. Nope. <laughs> I thought the same thing. I was like, <laughs> was that a goon that just got out of that shuttle? Oh. Yeah. Oh. Dude, shuttle oh, micro scares me. Oh, no. That's Bagel rip for Bagel. Yeah, that's... That's huge. Why'd you get doing a great job? 
Yeah, you basically aim move the goons and then don't focus all your attention on the bill. Oh, he doesn't have an observer here, does oh, he's, he, though? He's amazing. Pick up the shot! Pick up the reavers! You crazy bastard! Get him in there! Oh, we saved one at least. Wow. Clutch DTs. Oh! And we and sniped the, the shuttle! just arrived. Oh! The observer, like, observer shows up. Did I miss something? <laughs> <laughs> oh, what's going on here? Is there a fight? Huh, that's cool. Oh, hey, look, Six. guys, I found some DTs. <laughs> Is everything just dead? So six gates on each side. Yeah, why two? Uh, Bagel Pirate looking like he's setting up to expand again. Great time to do so. Doesn't necessarily need to, but it's a nice way to secure uh, further advantage. Win a fight, uh, take a base. Lose a fight, take a base. <laughs> oh, it looks like a, the probe killed the pylon at the top. At the top base. What a Chad. What a Chad. So. Oh. Y2 trying to take an expand. A bold choice. DT says right no, thank base, you. Eh? True. Uh, I feel like Bagel Pirate's Nexus is misplaced. Slightly. But that's yes. Fine. I'm pretty sure that's misplaced. It, it, it's hard to place Nexuses, you know, when, when you don't have a gas to, you know, cuddle it. <laughs> like, True. Dude, where, where do I put it? <laughs> You need you need the soft, gentle cupping of the gas to understand exactly. where your main building goes. But also, just like look at the mini map. <laughs> I know. <laughs> no, I mean, you're not gonna cancel it though. Oh, coward! All right, Zell's gonna come out here and see the army. Don't cost three hundred minerals. True. That sounds like a skill issue, though. I mean, these zealots are going to really make a huge difference in this fight. Zealots are so annoying at a certain point in the game, especially if they have legs. Oh, wow, we have a reaver in the main of Bagel Pirate. Oh, hello. Killing probes. 15 kills. 18. 18 kills. 20. 20. We have a reaver in the natural as well. It looks like he's safe against the forces of Bagel for the time being. Bagel is moving into storm I think. Now. I think Y2 just won. Um... Possibly. He did this, right? He's just slaughtered 22 workers. All right? And he's got a reaver at home. So unless he absolutely whips it at home, he should be fine. Storm is really good against reaver. True. If you can get a good storm on top of the shuttle, you can kill it in one storm. Especially when it's got low shields like this. Huh? Oh, you mean like and that? There we go. <laughs> exactly like that. Uh, we just kind of stand in the storms, but at the end of the day, how many? What do we got? I think we uh, just have more goons. Gonna, he's not gonna break through. Yeah, the pylon's doing a lot of work there. You see how much damage yeah. that one pylon broke? That's two goons' lives that that saved. At least, yeah. Maybe three goons' lives. Yeah, the storm is a good unit. Who would have thought? That's fine. When in doubt, build another reaver. I mean, we'll, we'll build another base since Bigger <laughs> Pirate is now up at four base. I think it's slightly overkill, but... Oof. Big reaver shot. He needs to back up. He needs to get out of it. Blonk. Oh. Yeah, all right. Get out of there. Run. Uh, no, he's all right. All of, all of these now. I think Bagel Pirate has plus one, by the way, and Y2 has no upgrades. I don't think plus one makes that big a difference for a goon this game. Maybe yeah, I mean, it doesn't affect a reaver at all. All right. Okay, so what do we got here? We got a, a small force, nine goons, two zealots. We got seven goons, seven zealots, and a reaver. If Y2 Kid doesn't press the issue right, well, it looks like it's too late. Yeah. It looks like Bagel Pirates already uh, used his superior economy and just built more stuff. Yeah, it's he's got a Y2 still has a slight advantage in supply. 
Especially when you consider that Bagel Pirate just has more workers. But it's definitely a, um, well, kind of need to do something now. Yeah, he needs a shuttle with these two Reavers. But before the storm, well, the storms are going to be ready. Yeah, it's looking tough. Yeah, it's not an easy one, but we'll see. We'll see. I think... It looks like Y2 Kid. Oh, there's a DT on that base. Oh, no. Does he get oh. the probe? Yeah. <laughs> oh, he no. got the alert, too, and then it just... That's fine. He needs more observers. Like, where the hell is his observer? I mean, he's just building Reavers, man. True. Since Bagel's on the um, on the High Templar, he can build observers all he likes. Yeah, uh, and Storm is just generally better splash to have in your army. Oh, this could be... Oh, that's um, a Um, Storm. Reavers need to target the Templar. Oh, no. Somehow Actually, that shuttle dodged all the energy. Yeah, I don't know how that <laughs> didn't do any damage to that shuttle. I'm sure. Huge fight from Y2 Kid. Huge. I think... Uh, yeah, this might be what he needed. Okay. This might be a good... Oh, oh my god! No, click the workers! Um... Oh, well, we're yeah. gonna lose this. <gasps> no! Oof, that was close. He's losing the Reavers to the cannons, though. Yeah, that but, was a... I mean, that was, that was bad almost bad. Stuck the big army. Yeah, but if we can get one of these shots into the mineral line, if he actually microed. Wait a minute. Did he just entered all the zealots. No, but... Yep. Oh, GG.